What's up guys, welcome to Ben and I Sell Guy and what I have for you today is actually an app review from Cydia and if you guys don't know what Cydia is, it's basically like a store that you get when you jailbreak your device so you do have to be jailbroken in order to get this but what I'm going to be reviewing today is called Sarah now if you guys are familiar with Siri on the iPhone 4S maybe some of you guys have it, maybe you, some of you guys don't or voice dictation that's on the new iPad, the third generation iPad you guys know that Siri is basically a voice assistant where you can tell it to call so and so and you can basically have a conversation with Siri. Well, Sarah is basically the same experience. Now, I'm going to launch it up right now as I am talking to you guys because this is the iPhone 3G and yes, this is actually support on the 3G. You can tell because all the labeling back here is faded whereas the iPhone 3GS is chrome and I'm going to lower it down here so Sarah is not talking to me. But um yeah, so this is basically a Siri, and you can have a conversation with it as well. Now, it's not the best solution. Like, it, it's almost as good as Siri. I, I can tell you that right now. But now, this is coming from a perspective where I never even played with the actual Siri before because I never owned an iPhone 4S, and I haven't actually touched an iPhone 4S before. I touched an iPhone 4, but not an iPhone 4S. So, without further ado, here's Sarah. So we're gonna click on this question mark right here, and it's basically, uh, you can like get different things, like it'll suggest what you can do. So as you can see, it gives you suggestions on what you can say, you know, call Alex, go home, uh, doesn't matter. And of course, if we click on the settings right here, you have some settings right here, you have your name, which I changed my name to Ben, because before it was saying, hi Martin fam or something, you do have to edit that yourself. Uh, PC address, RSS URL, your city, mine's is Bristol, and that's basically for when you're asking Sarah to check the weather forecast. Uh, Sarah voice, you can have it on or off, and so on and so forth. Dictation, you can have it in English, and I have it in English US. So without further ado, let's turn the volume all the way up, and you basically have your, your help button right here, as well as your OK button right here. So you can confirm the settings and help. It just gives you on more assistance on what you need. So without further ado, let's get on with it. What's the weather like today? Now this is the iPhone 3G. This is actually supported. I'm getting today forecast. This is also supported on the iPhone 2G, 3G, iPod Touch 3G. It, it basically supports all the older devices as long as you're jailbroken. However, on those older devices, in this case, like I do right here, it does take a little while for Sarah to get what you need. So as you can see, mostly cloudy in Bristol today. I'm looking for Walmart. Now, as you can see, like sometimes it's not very accurate. Like you do have to take your time sometimes in order to have Sarah recognize what you said. So we're gonna try that again. I'm going to Walmart, period. And you can't say it too slow, otherwise uh, Sarah won't be able to keep up with you. Okay, so it's not going to even work, but you could actually use this to search in your Maps application if you needed a place. All right, now, uh, what you can't do with this is basically uh, set reminders, set an alarm. Uh, you can't do any of that. So, uh, without further ado, let's actually do Siri dictation on here where we actually play with Siri. What is the meaning of life? Question mark. And you do have to say the punctuations in order for it to show a question mark or a period, but uh, you know, sometimes it's not going to work. Wow. 
what is the meaning of that. Okay, so Sarah isn't then like really recognizing. I'm surprised because I actually played around with this earlier or a few days ago and Sarah is kind of messing up on me. Let, let me try that again. What is the meaning of life? This is taking a while. I do apologize for that. What's the meaning of life? Oh, uh, okay. Well, I'm just gonna go on. Let's do something more simple. Will you marry me? Hello, my God. All right, guys. So we have a problem because Sarah actually just crashed because, uh, and that's not a surprise to me because the uh, this, this this did happen to me a few times. So. Uh, it's always best if you guys use the newer devices like the iPhone 4, uh, iPod Touch 4th generation, etc. Will you marry me? Okay, so as you can see, it said yes, whereas Siri will just be like, let's just be friends, okay? And then, yeah, it's not gonna want to be your spouse. <laughs> I love you. No, no, that's wrong. All right, well, I'm not gonna waste your time here because it, it is taking a little bit too long. But anyway, Sarah is a great application from the city of store. Trust me, yeah, you, Sarah wasn't acting like this before, but it actually does work for me. So make sure your device is jailbroken. Uh, you guys don't know how to jailbreak, you'll have to search it up on, on Google or search it up on YouTube because it'll just depend on what device you have and what firmware you're on. For me, I'm on the iPhone 3G, so I'm on iOS 4.2.1, and it was an untethered jailbreak for me. But when you jailbreak it, you're gonna get the Cydia store right here, the Cydia icon right there. And I'll have the repo where you're gonna download from in the description below, or it'll just have an annotation that'll appear right on your screen. And then I'm gonna tell you which package you're gonna download as I am seeing this currently. Anyway, guys, this was a review of Sarah for jailbroken devices, which is a Siri mock-up, I guess you would call it, a somewhat Siri experience. For more updates, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash guy, and go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just click on my logo at the top right-hand corner to subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.